Welcome back, fellow adult children nerds, <clears throat> to the ridiculous Megazord review, or should I say the Lionfire Fortress Zord review. And now let's get to combining them with the Ninja Steel Megazord and parts of the Bull Rider Megazord. First things first, we gotta turn that crown around, which will be off camera. Next, we will be turning the entire upper half completely around. Assuming we don't make parts fall off. Oh, listen to that audible click. You no, it's secure. And now we have this gaping void with Jordy LaForge's visor face on top. <laughs> okay, first we put the Megazord in that void. And... He's already ready to combine. Oh, earthquake! Ah, keep smacking into stuff. I believe he's in place. Hang on. Okay. I believe the Megazord is secure. Like so. Man, he looks like a two-year-old on an adult-sized throne. Next, we take the legs of the Bull Rider Megazord and attach them to the arm pieces of the Zord. They just sort of friction in there. And they're not entirely even, but You sort of raise the legs up a bit, or the feet up a bit. They're a little less um, silly looking. <clears throat> and since normally the rest of the Bull Rider Megazord is supposed to fit on the back, instead we're going to take the leftover parts and put them in the cage. So that way you won't have to worry about them getting stepped on or lost. Actually this could be easier said than done. Okay, first, we take the sword and shield of the Megazord, put those in there, the weapon of the Bull Rider and the stabilizer piece, throwing star, um, this piece. The bull rider, the bull head, 
And you don't really put them in there in any sort of order. You just sort of finagle them in there. Now this is my personal choice. Um, so they don't get lost. And unfortunately, that leaves the arms and torso of the bull rider uh, out. But for the most part, the body of the bull rider is in the back of the Megazord where it belongs. And now we turn them around. And I present to you, for lack of a better term, the Ninja Steel Ultra Zord. And no, this time things don't explode because it's awesome. Things completely vaporize because it is ridiculous. And this is going to be the big Zord of the season. I have something of a theory concerning the future Megazord, which is supposed to fit in there, but I don't know how it's going to fit in there. <clears throat> um, the next Zord to fit in there is going to be called, I think, the Inferno Megazord. It's going to consist of all six Rangers in Zord mode, and they all combine to form one Megazord. But I don't know if this is going to work with that. Let's hope so. Until then, this is Mr. J signing out. Go, go, Ninja Steel.